Wow, so today we are having our Independence Day extravaganza event for the first time right here in downtown on Avenue D and Gray Street. We have a variety of vendors. We have some craft vendors. We have Habitat Humanity here today. And then we just have all types of small businesses that are selling jewelry, apparel. So we have a variety of vendors out here today. We put the sauce on it, it's hot. We have the same thing happening with the food truck. It's a, it's a big variety from Caribbean to uh, Mexican food, to Panamanian. It's a lot of options. So as far as the kid activities, we have some bouncy houses, bungee jump, and then we have rock climbing as well. So we had Houston hip hop artists, Huntin' came out, opened us up. And then we followed up with a Constantine band, which is American folk rock group. They did an awesome job. Um, the reggae band is just now getting off the stage and they drew in a big crowd as well. And now we're getting ready to end it with a Maj, which is our country singer from Dallas. Yeah, so I think a lot of the people that are here today are pretty amped up about the fireworks show with it being the first one that we're doing. So the fireworks show is gonna be actually launching from the Colleen Athletic Complex. However, there's gonna be visibility in downtown. So the people downtown are not only gonna be able to see it, but they're also gonna be able to hear it. And I love it because this is part of our revitalization of downtown Colleen. And with Mr. Lavalis and the city manager and the staff all working together to get the people out it's just the beginning because with the vendors being here at Brainston, that social economics that is needed to continue to boost the revenue for these small businesses that's downtown. So I'm very excited about what is going on. We have concerts all throughout the night. We have our fireworks show at 9.30 and this is something for every family member. So the first one we did was the Christmas one in December, Hiding of the Stars, that was great. We had a lot of people come out. And since then, we've just been trying to be consistent with putting out quality events for downtown. And so this one right here, I would probably say is probably one of the biggest turnouts we've had outside of Celebrate Colleen. So I'm pretty satisfied with it. I think that people are excited about seeing things happening in downtown. I can't tell you how many people have stopped me and just said they really love what's happening in downtown. So we're on the right track. Yeah, look at that. We want this place to be a place where families can come throughout the week and just walk around and visit the shops and, and the restaurants. I envision that happening in the future of our downtown area. So we're starting now as we have been hosting events throughout the year. For citizens watching this, the first thing I would say is come downtown. If you've never been downtown, if you've never been to a downtown event, you have no idea what you're missing out on. There's some really good things happening down here. So I would say, give it a chance. Come out here, check it out for yourself. If, you, if you're an interested vendor that want to participate, all you got to do is go on our website, colleentexas.gov slash downtown events to get the vendor form. And also you can give me a call. I'll be the go-to guy. It's 254-501-7758. I hope that it would not only just show people, showcase what we have in downtown, I hope that the small businesses will get more traffic, get new customers, and perhaps we may even get new businesses that may see what's happening in our downtown and the synergy that we have, and maybe consider bringing their business to our downtown so that we can continue to revitalize.